soil structure is a key aspect for all soil functions. How to evaluate the soil structure quality was the best method. Simple and fast, the whole evaluation takes about 15 minutes. For that, you need to extract a block with a spade. Ideally, you'll dig up to 30 centimeters depth in order to be under the plow pan. And then there is this chart to evaluate the soil structure. So, one is the best score, five is the worst, and three is the limit between a good structure and a poor structure. Here is the material you need. A spade, a tarp, a measuring tape, a camera, a vest sheet, and something to write. So you start with the first hole and then you can extract a block with the spade. Once you extracted the block, you have to distinguish the different layers. We'll measure the length of each layer and then determine the score with the sheet. To evaluate a score, we'll have to look at several criteria. First is aggregate size. And second, you look at the shape of the aggregate. And then you evaluate the inner structure. Then you can compare the observed structure with the pictures and the descriptions and pay attention to the porosity and how the roots move inside the clod or aggregate. The first layer is a score of two. The size is about from two millimeters to seven centimeters. It's quite round. If I open a little clod, I can see it's made of smaller rounded aggregates and I can also see that it's quite porous inside. For the second layer, we'll give it a score 3. Pretty much looks like the pictures and also from the size, it's 2 millimeters to up to 10 centimeters. If you open a clod, it reveals rough faces. They're not as porous as what we had before. So a score three is pretty good. To calculate the score of the block, you simply do a weighted average. To have good conditions of observations, you should avoid a soil that is too wet or too dry or that has been recently tilled. Five evaluations are necessary to be representative of a homogeneous field. With this method, you already have a good idea of the soil structure quality of the field. But if you need more precise measurements of soil structure quality, then you can have a look at our video that shows how to take undisturbed soil samples and measure them in the lab.